you are in no communication and you want to know what will be the next move of your person this reading might be for you i don't know it's a collective reading take what resonates leave what doesn't if you want to book a paid private reading you can email me at divinemothersguidance@gmail.com okay and scammers steal my video they make fake profile everywhere so just to let you know i have only one account divine mothers guidance with 119k plus followers in tiktok and only one account divine mothers guidance with 3700 plus followers in instagram i have only one youtube channel let's us travel please subscribe to my youtube channel if you can to support me and um, i never approach you scammers steal my video and make hundreds of fake profile here and there in telegram facebook i don't have those telegram friends so if you see somebody following you offering you a reading that is a shit show okay don't entertain with them after that if you are scammed you are scammed don't tell me don't send me those fucking emails saying that i've been scammed i can't help about it all right i can't do anything about it so let us think about your person and let us see what their next move when you are in no communication oh la 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 high priestess okay it seems like you deep inside know what they're going to do next they are showing me the snake okay transformation king of cups bullshit what the fuck the creator oh king of show literally jumped we were dealing with somebody oh my goodness what is this knight of pentacle i hate this knight i seriously hate this knight because this is works like a snail this is the fucking slowest knight of the deck okay but they're moving but moving very slow okay so here comes king of show and king of cups now 10 of pentacle oh my years 2 of pentacle temperance okay 3 of cups 2 of wand high priestess the creator and here comes the empress okay what i'm seeing the situation here it can be that you can be married they can be married if both of you are not married somehow there is a third party situation going on here all right um it can be also like if you are not married that can be also father mother donkey monkey michael cycle whatever shit whatever shit their all work their addiction their job i don't know you know your person whoever now what i'm sensing here there is a third party situation going on and um, if you don't have a husband or you don't have a third party or a wife or they don't have something in their side there is a person who is very dominating have a lot of control over the situation okay this person is is taking a, a lot of action um, in this situation to distract this connection and like you know in this separation whatever happening um your person king of cups so this person is sometimes very emotional very emotional thinking at this moment very emotional thinking about you all the good time feeling over him but you know what with this king of shows a problem king of what they will be thinking and being emotional but at the end of the day taking no action okay king of even there is a king is quite like a feminine energy so it's like a like a suki lala type all the bullshit going on in their life but taking action bullshit nothing um they are deciding even though they are deciding because they are missing you big time okay look at the temperance they are trying to balance their emotion look at the face so they are trying to balance their emotion a part of them definitely saw a future with you a marriage a future a stability commitment with you but a part of them is still like holding on i don't know whatever but they see you as empress you again you might be married or you can be a little bit older than them there might be age gap or the empress is also the queen of the queens you are really somebody in their life who they can't replace in their life you can be a queen you can be king whoever but you are wherever you are king of the kings you are creative you are you are you know you have a, you have your own shit together you are beautiful you are doing your business your job you have your own fucking world where you can focus and you can live and this and you are also glowing you are in the empress energy so whoever you are i believe you are working on yourself a lot so you are not needy you are not asking for their validation you are doing you and that is freaking this person out i like what the fuck why this person is not running behind me okay i was i was expecting they will be crying suki lala and you know you are not doing it you are glowing you are taking control of your own world and that is big time fucking with their mind and that's why the king of cup energy but at the end of the day with the king of cup energy this person is still deciding what to do still deciding what to do um two of pentacle and the temperance i think they are, this person is juggling too many things too many things um they might be juggling their third parties their their of, uh, office their job their business whatever it is they are juggling too much so there are a lot of um, things going on in their plate um 
so with also the two of wands so there are two twos here two two can be a two two, two it might be a significant number for you um so yeah but again with the third party card also also this card is also giving me a vibe of reconciliation so i believe with this person i believe they have a part of them definitely wants to come forward towards you okay definitely wants to come forward to towards you but i with, with the creator card is got a, some extra cards in this deck so the creator card a lot of turmoil is going on in their mind so they are not very really sure the spark you know you know the thunderstorm and everything going on around they are not yet sure what to do so i believe with the knight of cups and underneath the tight knight of cups is five of shirts so i was knight of cup uh, sorry knight of coin is a card is very slow moving card i believe this person also with the king of shirts energy with the knight of pentacle i would say king of shirts is somebody who is a lot of thinking going on they think a lot they make a lot of analysis they very cold hearted person in general they are not very good at expressing their emotion not good with emotional regulation they just try to think and think analytically but they within them the love that is sitting there inside their heart they don't know how to tune with that okay this people like you know they feel the love but they don't know what is like what exactly it is then they feel that there is something going on inside them which is pushing them towards you they are longing for you but they don't know what is that feeling so they don't even want to accept their own feeling that i love this person i'm missing this person they want to deny it they want to um sabotage their own feelings they just want to suppress it like you know um numb it by doing alcohol or by going third parties and bullshit so this is what going on so i believe this person is going through all those things and also they have a very high level of confidence that you're going to come back to them okay so all i would tell you if you are dealing with this shit don't go back to this person do not message them go live life go forward work with your boundaries uh, you know self love practice your life with your self love you know put yourself back on pedestal do things for yourself do not run behind this person at all because they need to go with their own emotion because if you go right now they will get the validation for the shit that is going on in their head do not give them the validation you do your life because once this person realize that you are not going to come back to them then they will be forced to analyze their own feelings that i miss this person i love them i need them in their life and there is no way this person is going to come back to me so the only option to get them back is to go through a ego death and go to this person and bring them back so if you message them right now it is going to be a complete disaster for you for 100% sure do not message this person rather than the the temp empress energy you are in just keep doing that focus on your business your job because that is actually working that is actually working so focus on your life even if you sad sometime it will be plus minus there will be days when you will be feeling sad there will be days when you will be feeling depressed that's normal very very normal so uh, be kind to yourself keep doing your life and you know what let me tell you one thing if somebody doesn't want to be in your life if you run behind them it is not going to help you it is not going to help you it will make you a fantastic doormat who is lying down over there if i want i will open the door and look at you and then shut the door for you that treatment if you want to get go and message them go and message them and if you don't want to get the treatment want to be treated respectfully spend another couple of months crying and working on yourself healing yourself couple of months might be very disaster but you can do it for the rest of your life to be in a better situation you can go better for crying it is going to go either way either this person will heal and meet you somewhere or they will be taken away from your life once you heal i said it you do your shit okay you do your shit take care